Hi, this is PHP training course and today is day 15. I will tell you how to work with the server side form validation in PHP. Okay, so now let's get started. Close this one. Open the sublime tag. I will create a new file. Save it. Okay. Form. Server. Okay. 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 Okay, open the browser. Okay. And here, when the user submit the data from this Click on submit button here. We will send the data to the server, and we will check on the server side if if the name is blank or email is blank, gender is known. So we will display the error message here. Here, okay. Um, method oh. action. Email special chat. I have a sugar. Mm. 
fp cell okay so here the html special chart here will be convert the special character to the html and we have the server php cell here mean action when we submit the action to the server it will recall or reload this current bed in this direct it to another bed so here we will recall this bed to submit the data okay it will call itself And I will also create some the variable to store the, the, the error message returned by the server. Here I will be checking if I have a server. server. This would be the request uh, request method because here we are using the port method. So I will check it here if equal. Okay. Continue checking if the empty empty from port. I have F F name. If M may be empty, I will assign an error message B. Mm, name B required. Otherwise, F name, it should be mm, bot. F name. Okay. So here we do the same thing with email and gender. Email. F email. Mm, name. Email. And gender. Mm, sorry. Name error, error, name email, gender, yes, and this one, name, this one, email, and gender. Okay, so now here we are going to display the error message in 
flow to to eat take off here okay and I will be using uh, okay I'm using a span okay span and PSP echo error mm. message okay error message Email and gender. Refresh is and the name of the or street nice nine okay here if uh, your server oh, okay Hey, okay, name you require, email you require, and gender you require. This. Okay, I will make this one e in red so it will be easier for us to take a look into it. Okay, I will. Okay, I will create a style here. Head. Head. Head style. This one should be okay. So, okay, I will use short code in spec and body yeah. So you can see here when we are using the the, the PHP cell, it will automatically generate the the, the current path. Yeah. The form validation server dot PHP and here it will be automatically generated the the file name here. For action, okay, cool. Okay, here. So now I will go ahead to create a session here. When we enter the valid name, email, and gender, so I will be display the the, 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 the information entered by user into the net. Okay, here. Now this one, I will have to bring some thing. PHP. Okay, I will have a mm, echo. B. Make sure that it will draw information as below.
Virginia. to browser and trying to refresh this thread to see the new chain apply here okay in college enter the name in zero zero ps as in your account then there also in there submit yeah oh uh, gender Okay. Gender value it should be female. Okay, refer this again. Yeah. Okay, cool. Okay, so I think that's all for today. And after you finish this video, you know how to do the server side validation by using the PSP. And we also we also display the the message on the same pet. Instead of direct it to another pet, we, we we can use the PSP uh PSP cell uh for the first server checking to 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 do the action on the current pet. Okay. Thank you for watching and let me know if you see any issue. Bye bye and see you later.